Hi, this is Sai with Cisco Direct Hyperflex team. In this video, we're going to learn how to put Hyperflex node into maintenance mode. Please do not perform these steps if cluster is in unhealthy state. Let's log into HX Connect, confirm cluster health state, node failure can be tolerated. Click on the system information. We can see this is a three node cluster. Click on the nodes and click on the, the node that you're wanting to put in the maintenance mode and confirm the HX maintenance mode. We can monitor the, the HX maintenance mode process in the activity tab. Click on activity tab. We can see the maintenance mode process has started. Wait for some time and refresh the tab. We can see the maintenance mode process is completed successfully. Let's go to vCenter and check the same. The node is already in the maintenance mode. Click on the virtual machines to make sure the control VM is powered off. As per the vCenter, it is powered off. Now let's power off the, the node by right clicking on the node from the vCenter and click power and shut down. And this will give option to shut down the host. Put the reason to shut down the host and then click OK. So that will start the power off the node. Wait for some time and the power off process is going to start. Refresh the page and it should power down. Let's log into UCS Manager and let's wait for it to reflect on the UCS Manager. And we can see the overall status changed to power off, which means the server is already powered off and good to go into the maintenance mode. And click on the, the server maintenance and decommission tab. Click OK. So this is going to remove the server from the inventory so you can complete whatever the activity that's needed on the server. You can check the, the status from the FSM so we can see the server is no longer present in the UCS manager. Complete the activity for the, the server. And once the activity is completed, connect the power cables back. And from the recommission tab, you can re recommission the server by, by clicking on the checkbox, save changes, and that will bring back the server into the UCS inventory. Yeah, now we can see the server for is popped up into the UCS manager. We can see also from the vCenter server is reachable. Refresh the page. You can see the server is back on and it's in the, the maintenance mode. Now, let's log into the HX Connect and exit the maintenance mode of the server from there. Click on the system information, click on nodes, click on the node and exit maintenance mode. We can monitor the activity in the activity tab. Click on activity tab and the exit maintenance mode process has started in the activity tab. And from the vCenter, we can see node is already out of the maintenance and under the VMs, the control VM is already powered off. So the cluster should be healing soon. Check the HX Connect GUI, refresh the page. Let's log into CLI to the cluster IP to check the cluster state. Run the following command to check the cluster state from the CLI of the HX Connect. From the output, we can see the cluster is back on healthy and number of nodes failure can be tolerable is changed back to one, which is expected for a three node cluster. And as per HX Connect GUI, everything is online, hypervisor and hyperflex controller. And node is back online as well in the nodes tab. And in the dashboard, we can see cluster status is back to healthy and one node failure can be tolerated. 